do, 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 do. I'm going shopping. Right. Name tag and a few carrots. All right. Let's go ahead and name this guy. There we go. And who are we going to give this name tag to? Obviously, this guy over here. For those of you guys who have recently watched my hardcore series, you're going to know why I'm calling this guy this. Yeah. Yeah. And I don't appreciate you, sir. There is a reason you are entrapped in a prison. In fact, you know what? I have a theory, guys. I have a theory. I think Stinky Butt here sent all of his minions in my hardcore series to kill me. Right? You know? Sent them all the way from this series over to that one to kick my butt. You know? That's 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 my theory. That's my theory. You. You, we have a per we have a vendetta right now. We we're, we're about to go to freaking war. I don't I'm not okay with that guy. <laughs> but guys, welcome back to another episode here of the Let's Play series. I do hope you guys are having a fantastic day. Back for the 81st episode, guys, and we are looking bit down good today oh yes we are so yeah spoiler alert in the last article episode we died episode three the episode three curse continues ladies and gentlemen yeah what else can i say what else can i say i will go ahead and confirm right now that uh, i will go ahead and restart that series on a brand new world at some point the overwhelming majority of you guys were saying oh hey just go ahead and restart it like that 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 death was kind of bogus you deserve another chance so yeah we'll go ahead and restart it at some point ladies and gents but uh yeah if you guys are excited for more episodes of this series to come if we could keep going on with the 3000 likes per episode that would be absolutely fantastic now i've got a rough idea idea as to what I want to do in today's episode. I want to go ahead and start working on the walls here. The only stipulation is I don't really have that much blackstone left. I think I've got just over one row of blackstone left uh, to work with. Uh, where is it all? Oh, so there's some there. Uh, there's a little bit in there. I think I've got little bits and bobs sort of dotted all over the place, really. But uh, the fact of the matter is, I don't think we're going to be able to get too, too much done here today. But... I'm going to try and push myself to get as much stuff as I possibly can done today. Ow! Son of a gun, dude. Ow! Ah! Ah! Okay. Jesus. Okay. Wow. Wow. That's, that, that's, that's, that's how we're going to start today, huh? Ah, so there we go, ladies and gents. A lot of you guys were saying, and quite correctly so, that we couldn't really see the guys in there, right? So there we go. We can now go ahead and see them a bit better. We've got Stinky Butt over there, and we've got Zoggy over here. And, uh, yeah, because they're both, technically speaking, above one block tall, they will never be able to get out. So, yeah, as long as we don't fly near this guy and get impaled on his freaking horns there. I mean, look at, well, not horns, tusks, whatever you want to call them. Ooh, they're nasty. They're nasty, guys. We don't want to get on the wrong side of them, you know what I'm saying? Uh, so, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy okay so let's try and uh, garner ourselves all of the blackstone we have available to us we've got the quartz bricks of course as well and um, we've still got a whole bunch of like other blackstone bits as well oh my goodness yeah we got we got we've, we've, we do have a fair amount all right guys so we're taking the wall only up until this point because out the back here i think i'd quite like to have some sort of uh, backyard going on although with that said uh hmm I don't know, man, because I don't want to get rid of, like, all of these mountains. Do you know what, actually? I feel like the backyard might actually be better in this corner. I mean, yeah, we might have to terraform this entire mountain out of existence. But then we can have, like, a really nice area here where we've got, like, a fantastic view of the mountains in the background there. Uh, and then, oh, man, that could be such a cool thing, man. That could be so freaking cool. Hmm. Okay, well, maybe we don't have ourselves a backyard out the back here, huh? I don't know. I haven't really, uh, I haven't really uh, decided fully yet on uh, what we're going to be doing. So, ladies and gents, I think the time has come uh, to get this thing up and running, huh? So we need to go up to, I think well, it was 94, right? Okay, there we go. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. Perfect amount of blocks as well. You'll love to see it. Okay, so let's get this thing up and running. We need to begin with some stairs. Do we want to have? Do we want to have it be just one big window? Or do we want it to be, like, a couple of smaller windows? Hmm. Again, I don't really know. Do, 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 
do, do. Getting all the iron bars added in for all of the windows. Okay, right, that should be all of them. Yeah, okay. So, we're starting to get a pretty good idea of, uh, you know, the shaping of some of these rooms. Obviously, one thing I haven't really considered yet is how I'm going to be separating the different rooms, or even more to the point, what the different rooms are even going to have in them, right? Oh my goodness, I need to, I need to really uh, think about that one, huh? <laughs> oh man, oh man. This is such a huge project. It really is, isn't it? So let's take a look at it from the outset here. Yeah, that's looking pretty good, isn't it? Now, obviously, you know, we've got the underside to consider. Uh, there might be a little bit of terraforming to be done around here. I'd quite like to grass over all of this stone. I think that would make this place look a lot better, in my opinion. Ha <laughs> ha Yeah, guys. When you forget your shulker box contents and then you rediscover it and then you find out you got yourself a turn of grass blocks. Ha <laughs> ha! Fan freaking tastic! This entire place should be nicely greened over very, very shortly here, guys. And ladies and gentlemen, from grey to green, huh? It's looking a lot better, isn't it? Yeah, all right, all right, all right, all right. I am so ready to get this party started, my friends. Wait, what just happened there? That was weird. <laughs> all right, so we've now got all of this on the same level, which means we can now get all of these walls up and running. And to be honest with you guys, we're probably just going to go for the same kind of decoration as here. I mean, I'm really liking the lava uh, falls because, you know, they provide light for not only the outside, but uh, if we do things smartly, we could probably have them come in the inside side as well like for example if i got rid of this and then got rid of those stairs yeah actually that's not a bad idea i might do that for all of them yeah yeah yeah, yeah. then we've got some light on the oh goodness me uh oh uh, okay yep uh you do you there buddy <laughs> but yeah laugh on the inside it's it's a great idea isn't it i mean you know we might wind up burning ourselves but you know it's supposed to be like a, a hellish base isn't it so you know there's got to be a bit of risk involved you know what i'm saying <laughs> oh i'm so dumb all right well we're looking pretty good guys i've made some good progress today we're gonna keep on going there because i want to get the bottom sections done and then once we have all of that up and running, uh, I guess maybe we do some interior stuffs, I guess? All right, all right. I'll add in some little bars here and there. That should go ahead and help us stay alive a little bit better. Ah, huh? there we go. <laughs> it's a bit safer, isn't it, guys? <laughs> okay, coolio. Okay, so we need to go ahead and figure this thing out. Uh, I really am starting to run out of blackstone, though, so we're going to have to bear that in mind. But, uh, yeah, this is nine blocks wide, right? So I was thinking of doing, like, maybe one here, one here, in terms of the lava falls. Alrighty, guys. So I'm trying to work out the design for the bottom section at the side walls here. Uh, let's go and put this lava in, because I think that's going to be, like, the finishing touch for this area. And then I think we'll have a little bit better of an idea as to uh, how this is looking okay okay that's looking pretty good let's have a look at it from the inside it should be flowing inside as well and it is okay fantastic uh let's go ahead and maybe put some of these here slabberoos down gotta get some uh, progress on the interior done here yeah, I like it. I like it. We've got some good stuffs going on here, my friends. Now, obviously, you know, there's a bunch of decoration to be done here. Uh, we've got to put down some uh, iron bars again. Uh, in fact, to be honest, I just had a slightly different idea. Maybe what we do is we attach some of these walls, right? Because obviously the iron bars, they attach to walls nowadays. Yeah, that's a lot better. You know what, guys? Sometimes I really do astound myself with how stupid I am because, you know, we've got Morty the pack mule here. And, uh, yeah. Oh, goodness me. Uh, yeah, you guys all need to... Oh, my gosh. Yeah, you all need to remain on this post, but then we're taking Morty here. Uh, because... I remember, this guy's got, like, additional inventory slots, so even when my builder's inventory is full, I should just take Morty, and then we can get ourselves a bunch of lava buckets that way. See? Sure makes things a lot easier, doesn't it? And then we could even put a water bucket on you. Ha-ha! <laughs> ah, well, we've got to take this guy back with all of the lava weighing this guy down. <laughs> Ooh! Ah, yeah! That is looking great, guys! Huh? 
It's looking real good. Okay, I'm thinking maybe because these are larger walls, we can maybe get away with doing a little bit more detailing work here. Maybe we put in some stairs in the corner. Uh, eh, yeah, I mean, I, I'm kind of down with it. It does look pretty cool, I'd say. Uh, so yeah, let's go and get all of these things in. And I tell you what, we'll work on the interior a little bit in just a sec. You know what's super satisfying, guys, when you have the accidental perfect amount of iron bars to finish off your build? <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's so satisfying. It really, really is. Okay, so now we've got some of these to go on top, rather like this, because that's just what we're doing. Uh-huh. So let's get these on top of all of the walls. And then we've got some uh, some more stairs to put in, just to smooth off the pathway a little bit, you know, similar to here. Uh, so let's do that. Let's do that. Oh, we need some more. Darn it, man. All right, well, yeah. <laughs> Our Blackstone supply is getting critically low, guys. So we may have to head to the nether at some point. I'm not entirely sure I'll do it in today's episode, but certainly in between episodes, I'll uh, go and do that for you guys. Because, you know, I, wa I want to continue to make a whole bunch of epic progress with this thing. You know what I'm saying? And there we go, ladies and gentlemen. The interior walls are now looking very, very nice. I've even, like, smoothed off the ceiling really nicely as well. And yeah, just all in all, it's looking great, isn't it? Okay, so yeah, we now have somewhat of an idea of just how big this uh, this under the mansion void is going to be. But like I say, I think it'd be a really, really good idea for us to try and figure out where the center is. And then we try to make ourselves like a ginormous supporting pillar uh, for this thing. Like maybe all the way down at the bottom of the world, there's going to be something cool. Do we want to go all the way down to the bottom of the world? Eh, well, I'm not so sure about that just yet, uh, because, you know, that'd be a hell of a task. That really, really would, wouldn't it? Uh, but yeah, let's maybe do, I'm thinking maybe like a two by three, because that's got to be like the center here. You know, we've got two block window there, and then we've got one block wide pillar. So yeah, I think something like this might be a pretty nice idea. Okay, so that could be one ginormous supporting pillar, right? All right, guys, so the final thing I'll do in today's episode regarding this building here is we'll just go ahead and do a little bit of excavating here. Maybe we just try and get ourselves uh, this land all the way down to this level here. And then I think we'll go ahead and move on to something a little bit more fun. Maybe we do some exploring. Maybe we go out on the hunt for something. I don't know yet, man. I just feel like taking a little bit of a break because, you know, Blackstone Manor, it's a, it's a big old project, isn't it? Holy moly. <laughs> it's enormous, guys. It's a freaking huge project. Oh, my God. But I'm so glad that I uh, started it. I really, really am. I definitely needed a break from the hub project. And I feel like having, you know, maybe, maybe two projects, two main projects at a time. I feel like that's a pretty healthy balance between, you know, being able to focus on things and then not getting overwhelmed. It's when you start, you know, projects, you know, like every other day. Yeah, that's that's when the problems arise, guys. Oh, hello. There's a wolf under here. <laughs> Look at this guy. <laughs> Look at you. Look at you. You're adorable. All right. I mean, maybe we go ahead and tame him. I don't know if I've got any bones around, but I guess we'll, we could have a little bit of a look. Wow. Okay, so I'm really starting to get an idea of the scale of this build. I, I'm still unsure as to uh, how deep I want to go with this. Like, obviously, we're going to have this walkway up here. That's that's always going to be a thing. But yeah, around here, this is going to be where we start digging down. Maybe we go 20 blocks. Maybe we go 30 blocks. I honestly have no idea. Like, what would we even do down here? We could have like an under-the-mansion freaking city kind of deal if we really wanted to. You know, there are all manner of things that I could do under here. It's just a, it's just a case really of trying to pick something out and then just go with it. You know, go with the flow, get something started. Once we get something started, that's it. Up th I'm in it for the grind, dude. It's going to be fantastic, but yeah. <laughs> Brilliant. All right, guys, let's go to sleep real quick. We're going to do something a little bit more fun to end off the episode. Ah, there he is. Hey, buddy. Hey. Oh my god, it was the first bone. <laughs> Yay! We got a new pet dog. We got a new pet dog. Fantastic. Wait, where did he go? Oh, there you are. Hey, buddy. <laughs> you want to come on an adventure? Huh? Guys, you guys know what to do. Comments area. We need names. We need name suggestions. Go on, be creative, be funny. I don't know, man. I'll, I'll, I'm down for anything right about now. 
I'm just so happy I got another dog. Ah, oh, it makes me so happy. You know what, guys? I absolutely cannot remember whether or not we have found a mushroom biome on this world yet, right? Maybe we need to go ahead and see if we can find one, dudes. Oh my gosh. I mean, you know, we go into, what is it? Uh, Minecraft? No, no, no. Adventure. Yeah, we go down to the bottom. Adventuring time. We apparently only have six more biomes to try and find before this thing is done. So maybe the mushroom biome is one of them. Maybe one of them is the elusive jungle edge mountain biome, right? I don't know. There could be all manner of things going on. But yeah, I kind of want to. I kind of want to find a mushroom biome. And more to the point, I want to see if there's one that's uh, you know moderately close by, maybe a thousand, couple thousand blocks out maximum. That would be pretty cool. Hmm. All right. Well, I'll be honest with you guys. I've got no idea where my dog has wound up. I've got absolutely no idea. In fact, okay. Well, there's no death message, so I'm assuming he's somewhere. I've got no idea. I honestly have no idea. <laughs> he's just gone for his own little adventure. I don't even know. Like, I'm flying away. He's not teleporting here. Is he sat down somewhere? I mean, I don't, I don't remember telling him to sit. Hmm. Oh, well. Guys, let's go for an adventure. I want to find a freaking mushroom by him. That's what I want to do. That's the goal episode. Episode goal. Yeah, there we go. Got there at the finish. Eh, I don't know, my friends. I, I, I'm kind of figuring maybe we just sort of fly in one direction until we find one. I mean, I don't know if that would work. <laughs> I've got absolutely no idea just how far we would have to fly before we find ourselves a mushroom biome. Because, you know, they're pretty rare, right? Definitely one of the rarer biomes in Minecraft. So, we could be flying for a thousand blocks. We could be flying for ten thousand blocks. I just don't know, man. I honestly have no idea. But uh, maybe if we head more towards X0 and then just continue heading directly south, right? I feel like that'll be a pretty good way to go in terms of exploring here. So, yeah, I mean, let's just fly, man. If we find something cool, we find something cool. Okay, I would class this as being something cool. Uh-huh. Uh, oh, my gosh. That's, like, almost filled to the brim. Boom. Done. <laughs> oh, this thing's on the surface. I can't not. I can't not. It's on the surface. Oh, goodness me. I'm, I'm trying to look for a mushroom biome. The game's giving me a whole bunch of other stuff to do, though. Oh, I, I'm assuming the map room is down here, right? Um, wait. Oh, yep. There we go. Coolio. Uh, uh-huh. Uh-huh. I guess we are doing this? <laughs> no, it means going north again. I have to go the wrong direction to find this darn thing. Ugh. All right, all right. All righty. Try to perfectly position ourselves in the center, and I'm going to say it's down here. Yeah? Oh, it is. Oh, my God. <laughs> ah. Well, for those of you guys, uh, yeah. For those of you guys who ever doubt me, there you go. I, I literally am the master at finding these things, okay? It's just how it is. Sometimes you just got to accept when someone's better. Nah, I mean, I'm, I'm kidding, obviously. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. But I am kind of the master at finding a uh, buried treasure in, like, one foul sweep. <laughs> ah, okay. So, just over 3,000 blocks away from zero, 0, we have ourselves a witch hut. That's good to know, but uh, it would be nice if there's one slightly closer to home. Uh, because, yeah, it'd be kind of nice to make ourselves a witch farm again uh, at some point. So, yeah, I mean, that's a pretty cool find, I guess. Oh, yeah. Look at this area. Oh, my goodness. This looks amazing. I love it. There's, like, large mountain overhangs. There's, like, lava. Oh, God, that's starting a forest fire. We've got to get out of here. Ugh. I ain't, I ain't, I'm not staying around there. Okay. Oh, hello. That is... Oh, there's turtles here. There's... Ocean ruins? You lot shouldn't be here. Right, uh, I mean, I guess there's gonna be a ch Oh, hello. <laughs> hello, hello. There's gonna be a chest in here somewhere. Where are you, buddy? Where are you? You're definitely in here. Oh, there it is. <laughs> okay, what have we got? Curse of Vanishing. <laughs> what a- <laughs> what a great chest that is. Honestly, I feel like trying to stick to the ocean biomes would probably be our best bet in terms of finding a mushroom biome because more often than not, they are sort of in the middle of the ocean, right? So, it's- it's- it's possible. We're what, about 5,000 blocks away at this point? Yeah, I mean, just stick around the ocean. We might just find ourselves something cool. Okay. 
Okay, some more ru Oh my god. <laughs> ah, we got ruins and there we go. There's the mushroom island complete with a mushroom. Hey there, buddy. How you doing? How you doing there, broski? Uh, there's our adventure box. Do we have a bed in here? Yes, we do, baby. Awesome! Oh, man, we found ourselves one, guys. We found ourselves one. Okay, how far away? 6,000 blocks. Do you know what? Honestly, in terms of nether travel, that's actually not that far. It's, what, about 800 or so? Huh. Wow. All right, well, here we are. We found one. This is pretty awesome. I guess, uh, you know, if we're going to do the whole Project Pokemon, try to catch all of the mobs kind of dealio for one of our hub rooms. Yeah, we've got to try and capture one of these guys, huh? Yeah. Yeah, you're going to come live in the hub with me, huh? Maybe I'll try and get two of these guys. Then we can breed them up and get baby mushrooms. Oh, my gosh. I don't think I've ever bred up mushrooms before. Oh, this is so cool. <laughs> Ooh. Okay. I mean... So far, it seems pretty small. There's plenty of ocean surrounding it. There's a sunken boat right there. Ooh. There's like multiple islands, isn't it? Yeah, look at that. There's a whole bunch of them. Dude. Dude. This is cool. I like this. I like this a lot. See, the thing is, about this biome, uh, if you place down a grass block in the uh, in the Mushroom Island biome, it is, like, incredibly lush green, right? So let's go and grab ourselves some grass blocks, and I want to go ahead and show you guys this, because it's, like, so incredible. The grass color is so lush. It is beautiful. I absolutely adore it. So uh, let's get back over to our bed and whatnot. So well, that's just over here, right? Yep, there it is. And, yeah, I just want to show you guys this this real quick boom look how green it is look at that dude it's such an amazing like green color isn't it huh i'm pretty sure this is the same green color you get in jungle biomes it's just so lush it reminds me of the old minecraft beta uh biomes remember can you guys remember the old rainforest biome from way back then it used to have super green grass like this oh it's so nice. It really, really is. I'd love to be able to have super green grass around my base, but, uh, you know, well, you, you know, you got to deal with the cards that you were dealt, so, yeah. It's all good. But there we go, ladies and gents. We now have ourselves a mushroom biome. Wasn't that hard to find, and, yeah, we only wound up flying 6,000 blocks to the south, and here we are. Fantastic. I love it. All right, guys. Well, that's going to wrap it up for today's episode. We've uh, done the things that I set out to do. We've found a mushroom biome. We worked on Blackstone Manor. Got ourselves a bunch of epic plans going on. So, guys, if you have enjoyed today's episode, as always, a like rating goes a long, long way. I very much appreciate it. Hit the subscribe button. And don't forget to ding that bell if you don't want to miss out on future content. But for now, my friends, do have yourselves a fantastic rest of your day. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next episode.